Hey little man, how are you? How would you like to leave this? Huh? How would you like to go? <clears throat> so none of these animals have been spayed or neutered that we know of. These four in here have had babies potentially for the last few years and have eaten their young. Uh, there's two boys and two girls in this one. I don't know the exact sexes in this one, but there's five animals in here. Don't know if they are spayed or neutered. Here we have a little old lady who was at one time black, and she's an old lady, so I'm guessing between 11 and 13 years old. And then we have this boy over here who is in a 10 by 20 with a little barn attached. So he can uh, run and hide in this barn. Little tiny shed, about a six by eight foot shed. And he's hiding in there right now. I don't know if we can see him through the mixed wire. This habitat here is empty. And then there's this yard that's not being used. It was used at one time for them to run around in. And then there's another yard, much larger, that was once used for the wolves to run in and take turns. But that can't happen anymore because the uh, woman who raised them has passed away and her husband is now um, elderly and has had uh, a stroke and has difficulty maintaining the animals and has said that they must be gone by winter. So what their demise will be is uncertain if we do not rescue them and don't get them some a new place to live. Also, the family has offered up all of the chain link fencing for us to take back to our sanctuary. There's the run that they used to use uh, right alongside the back of that building and around. But uh, there are literally thousands of dollars worth of good uh, chain link fence that would be worth us taking out and bringing home in spite of the journey and labor. Uh, and these kennels here are actually paneled kennels that we could um, really, really utilize. So we're going to be requesting lots of help financially and physically from all of our friends and fans and members and sponsors of the Wolves at Wild Spirit Wolf Sanctuary. Uh, I cannot stress in the gravity and the need to rescue these animals from the current situation they're in. Everybody looks to be in relatively good health. Uh, we have one guy here, you can see, has got issues with his eyes. He's got, and it's hard to see with this little camera, but he's got a lot of pus coming out of his eyes, probably due to allergies. They said it happens almost always in the summertime. So, there you have it. This is a real dire need, so if anyone can help us out, because we need to begin now to rescue these animals.